From the moment I met you, life has been a blissful adventure. Today I promise to continue on our amazing adventure forever. You're the most caring, genuine, and loving person I've ever met. You've taught me to enjoy each moment in life and that two individuals joined together with respect, trust, and open communication are far stronger and happier than two people alone. I promise to always laugh at your jokes, and I already do. I promise to respect and cherish you as an individual, partner, and equal, knowing that we do not complete but complement each other. I vow to support you, trust you, and love you forever. Okay. The last 48 hours has proved everything I need. I needed to know about how amazing and powerful the love we have for each other is. Every single person here has shaped and crafted who we are today. And I couldn't imagine a more perfect day to marry such an incredible girl. You are the greatest thing that's ever happened. Your friendship, support, and love has made me a man I never dreamed I could be. And I cannot wait to spend the rest of my life with you. I promise to always be honest, kind, loving and supportive to you for the rest of my days. I could not imagine a life without you. I love you so, so much. And I can't wait to have you as my PIC forever. As the weeks went by and the calls kept coming in, the topic was always the same, Kate. A few months later, my curiosities were more than satisfied because I, get, I got to meet the beautiful, amazing, incredible, and always fun Kate. I thought Liam may have been exaggerating about. But as, as many of you know, Kate the Great is all those things and so much more. Over the past few years, my family and I have had the privilege of spending time with Kate. And we all agree, she is the perfect compliment to Liam. She calms him when he is stressed, which is a big job, and she picks him up when he is down. They have a beautiful and loving partnership, and I think I can speak for everyone in this room when I say that we're all lucky to be a part of it. As you two begin your married life together, I have no doubt that you will continue to do this better and better and that your marriage will not only be an encouragement to the two of you and a blessing to the two of you, but has been and will continue to be a blessing to those of us who get the pleasure to be your friends and your family each day. Kate, it's been an honor to be the lead of Kate and Lee these past 23 years. But Liam, there's no one else I'd rather, rather have be the other Lee in the family. So here's to the new Kate and Lee. Um, I'm so excited to have you as a part of the family. Congratulations, Kate and Liam. Love you both. Kate, we may not have a decade of history together, but we're not short on memories. From the moment I met you, I knew in my heart that we would be standing right here, right where we are today. You've got a heart larger than life itself, full of compassion and care. In your own amazing ways, I've watched you inspire Liam to grow and open his life to newer, better, and endless possibilities. The two of you have brought all of us so much happiness and so many memories. So together, let's flip the page and begin the next amazing chapter of your love story. When he looked into her eyes, he learned the most important part of the language that all the world spoke. The language that everyone on earth was capable of understanding in their heart. 
It was love. Something older than humanity, more ancient than the desert, what the boy felt at that moment was that he was in the presence of the only woman in his life, and that, with no need for words, she recognized the same thing. Because when you know the language, it's easy to understand that someone in the world awaits you, whether it's in the middle of the desert or in some great city. And when two such people encounter each other, the past and the future become unimportant. There's only that moment and the incredible certainty that everything under the sun has been written by one hand only. It is the hand that evokes love and creates a twin soul for every person in the world. Sometimes grace emerges from things that we don't expect, even things that leave a bad taste in your mouth, which leads to an even more nourished experience. I trust your partnership, which you start today, will give you the courage to be totally vulnerable, unafraid to share negative experiences, fully supported to enjoy the positive ones, and eager to experiment brand new things together, even non-fat, dairy-free, pineapple-flavored cottage cheese from Wickman's. Congratulations. I love Kate and Liam. You guys are freaking perfect. Um, like you said, you don't complete but complement each other. Um, literally, when you were talking about Liam, it was your other half. Like It was just this person that made you not just Kate, but an even better version of Kate and so comfortable and amazing and I don't you guys are just amazing what I love about Liam is that he's full of life love and energy and when he walks into a room everyone knows he's there now as an introvert that scared me a little bit but as I got to know Liam I realized that this comes from a place of love and it sure is true um, he makes Kate feel safe, he makes her feel loved, and he makes sure that each day holds an adventure for the two of them and everyone in their lives. So Liam, first of all, thank you for being that in Kate, and thank you for encouraging that in Kate. Kate, as an adult, you have taught me to value friendships and our family as you lead in this example by caring for your friends and prioritizing your family above all else. You have shared with me the value of spontaneity as you live a life full of joy and excitement with those around you, and you've shared with me a love of learning that you've shown in your dedication to your passion and all those around you. You've also showed me what it is to love unconditionally. You've accepted our differences, but more importantly, you've loved Liam and all that Liam is over these past five years, and it sets a great example for us all. Death do us part. Death do us part. Look at each other and remember this moment in time. Before this moment, you've been many things to one another. Co-workers, boyfriend and girlfriend, best friend, fiance. But now, you're crossing a new threshold of life. During the inevitable hard times and obstacles in your future, remember this very look in each other's eyes. Use that look to fuel your passions and fight your fires. That's your person your greatest advocate, and your partner in crime. Liam, do you take Kate to be your wife, promising to love, comfort, honor, respect, and care for her for the rest of your life? I do. Kate, do you take Liam to be your husband, promising to love, comfort, honor, respect, care for him for the rest of your life. I do. So this is the part of the wedding ceremony where an officiant would usually talk about how a wedding band as a perfect circle symbolizes eternity with no beginning and no end. But we all know these rings have an actual physical beginning. There was imperfect rock that was dug up from the earth. The metals and alloys are liquefied at over a thousand degrees, painstakingly shaped and polished producing these two rings that you're holding today. And love is like that. It's something beautiful, created, and shaped from imperfect, raw elements, humble beginnings, crafted over time, and ultimately priceless to those that hold it. 
Kate, please place the ring on Liam's finger and repeat after me. With this ring, I pledge my love and faithfulness to you today, tomorrow, and always. Liam, please place the ring on Kate's finger and repeat after me. With this ring, I pledge my love and faithfulness to you today, tomorrow, and always. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, I am honored to announce and present to you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. DeLapp. Liam, you may kiss the bride.